Maybe with your Scorpio, oh, this could resonate for your Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus sign. It's also timeless. It may not resonate for every Scorpio. But please be sure to like and subscribe if you like this content. Okay, now, getting into the message. The Scorpios that I'm picking up on. In the last week, I feel like there's something very, 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 very deep that you've uncovered within your own subconscious mind. This may be the universe talking to you. Right, this may be a very profound dream that you had. Um, or, or some of you, you've been looking for something, right? Or you've had a desire to know something or looking for information or something. And it's like it's, it's come to you through your senses, through your intuition. So um, I'm getting some of you are psychic for sure, okay? And you've been a psychic, um, so yeah, just take what resonates, or if it's not that, you're just very, very intuitive, okay? Now, what I'm getting is, somehow, some way, the universe has spoken to you, or you've had a premonition about your future, all right, and the path that you're supposed to take. Now, at the moment, there's this energy of you feeling quite detached from people, right? You may, you may have to interact with people, but it's like you don't really feel there like it's almost like you're a little bit dissociated because um uh, how can I explain it it's like it's like you want to keep yourself apart from people right somebody could be away from their normal location as well like maybe you guys are on holiday or something or you want to go on a holiday right some of you could be getting drawn to a specific location as well okay but basically now, if you're a business owner and you're looking at like the kind of team you want to bring together, this is where these premonitions are coming in as well. OK, so this is a very broad message, but it's it's really significant because, um, you know, if, if just this week, if you're feeling like, oh, just leave me alone, like, you know, you feel really um, protective over your energy and you just want to kind of spend time in your own energy, it's because there's something like integrating, okay? There's a very high vibrational energies or download that's kind of integrating into your system right now. So some of you could have, I feel like you could have successfully quantum leaped, quantum jumped or shifted timelines, okay? And it's like you're getting the tea from spirit, you're getting the downloads as it's happening. So if you feel exhausted or you feel like you don't really fit in with the people around you, just for this week or at this time, it's because there's a freaking whole journey you're about to go on, okay? Um, you know, this journey doesn't have to be physical. This journey could be mental. It could be emotional. It could be tied to your heart's desires. It could be tied to your destiny. But I know for certain that, I want to say God is, is preparing you right now um, to be very confident and to be very in your own energy when he says go right because like something's telling me like the universe is about to tell you go okay do it now <laughs> like do it like you know what i mean go buy it now go invest now go take action now go post it now right like like that's what i'm getting with you guys or go like go visit that place now you know what i mean and uh it could just be very spontaneous but i'm seeing there's like a weak gap in between so um, on top of that, you guys do have to kind of be careful f about certain energies that try to pull you back into an old timeline, okay? So what you want to stay focused on is what's coming, okay? Because you guys have actually moved on. Now, some of you are going to be moving overseas or you're going to be traveling somewhere, all right? Um, but be mindful of, of um, people and maybe even thoughts or memories and things from the past coming up because it's like right it's like right now you need peace some of you may be very drawn to water right now as well so if you feel drawn to water um go and like go get near it <laughs> you know what i mean just watch the water look at the water watch the sunrise watch the sunset because it's really going to help you just integrate whatever's trying to integrate right now because it feels massive it feels like like God's given you the tea, your higher self has really showed up for you in some way and it's guiding you on a very, onto a very bold path, okay? Like it's going to take a lot of courage. It's going to take a lot of confidence in yourself, right? And you've got to kind of protect your confidence. You've got to 
um, yeah, protect your confidence, especially from people from the past, because whoever this message is for, it's like there's things you've walked away from or people you've walked away from, whether it was recently or in, or in the distant past, like, but it was not easy for you to, I'm almost getting like claw yourself away from a certain group of people, an environment, um, whatever this is, like you, you did it though, right? And I feel like that's why you've been blessed with something, with with the ability to see clearly what, what God has for you, right? What, what the creator is doing in your life and what steps you're supposed to take. So yeah, let's see what else we can get, tribe. But yeah, I'm telling you, there's something about Oh, there may be, let me see, so someone is going to be getting communication from their mother this week, um, over the next week, this is really interesting, but what do we need to know? Right, someone, someone has been gotten, gotten the tea from their spirit team that either their mother or a, a feminine figure in their life is in is in serious competition with them okay or they they want to bring you down right and this is that fucking crabs in a bucket mentality someone's got a it's either like a mother figure or an, or like your actual mother right and they could be like coming in to communicate with you over the next week um but the thing is, you already know that this, uh, whoever this person is, they, I feel like they're very, there's something special about them, okay? Like, there is something very special and unique about this mother figure, um, but I'm seeing some kind of attack coming from this person, which is really interesting, because it's very interesting. So you may feel like you want to distance yourself from from a female, from a, like a mother figure. I don't know. It could be like, yeah, you take what resonates, Trad. But oh my God, right? It's like you got to have the fire and the water inside you. Is your fire on? Is it on? <laughs> That's what I feel like asking. Is your fire on? Because... If you don't feel like that thing's lit right now, in the center of your heart, you're about to be feeling like that, okay? It's like the stars are about to be within reach to you, right? It's like you're going to be, I'm getting that song, why don't we rewrite the stars, say that the world could be ours tonight. And it's like, that's the creator singing that to you, right? Let me, let me, let me look this up for a second here, because there's something there. You know, I want to, it's not a secret, I try to hide. I know you want me, so don't keep saying our hands are tied, right? Just imagine this is the creator singing to you for a second, right? So don't be, so it's like Spirit saying right now, if you feel like, you know, you just want to be alone, that's okay, okay? Your hands are not tied. You claim it's not in the cards and fate is pulling you miles away and out of reach from me, but you're here in my heart. So who can stop me if I decide that you're my destiny? So God says that he he wants to... It's like the creator has a plan for you, right? So why don't we rewrite the stars? Say you were made to be mine. Nothing could keep us apart. Like you are basically about to be formed into God's like <laughs> literal fucking divine precious child. Like... The creator is doing something very special with you, whoever this message is for. There's a reason that you've had this very profound dream in the past or recently. Okay, there's, you may be connecting certain dots right now at this point in time, but it's happening for a purpose. So if you feel like you need to be secluded, you know, just enjoy that peace because I'm telling you, when, when this green light goes on, it's fucking go time, guys. Like, it's going to be go time. And someone's going to be getting a new car, all right? But I do sense like there's little bits of fear here and there for this collective. So yeah, it's 
So the secret. So you, like God, God loves you. God wants you. It's not a secret that he, like the universe is not trying to hide that it's trying to hire you for something, right? The universe is not trying to hide how much it wants you for a certain position right now. And this is huge, okay? And the world is going to be yours, tribe. But heavy, heavy on the travel. Someone's going traveling. Someone is going to travel. Um, it may not be in the next week, but you're being prepared to go on a massive journey, right? This may be time traveling. This is something big, okay? You could, God is about to point out to you the destination, and you are going to go there, and he's going to pave the path there to this destination one way or another. Now, this has something to do with your destiny tribe, so it's not just exactly, you know, anything. This is actually really, really important, and I feel honored to do this message for whoever it's for. Because, yeah, you got a lot of spiritual protection around you. And, yeah, just be mindful of, like, random attacks from people from the past, okay? Remember, like, how people treated you in the past. Don't just forget these things, you know what I mean? Because, yeah, there's a reason, like, you're being separated from certain people right now. And it's because you're being prepared for something really, really major. A massive turn of events in your life, thanks to the Creator. So let me know if this resonated. Peace, drive.